Hello and welcome back to Mission Team of the Century Series 3 with Real Valladolid and we are back again. Um, I can't even remember what happened in the last episode because uh, I haven't recorded this in quite a while. Um, okay, so we got the 1-0 victory against Betis which I don't know why I can't remember. But yeah, as you can see, Oliveira getting the only goal in that match. I do remember playing the um, playing the Europa League game, and uh, I remember some of the teams having like no names. But yeah, let's get into the first game of this episode. We're up against Barcelona. Oh no, that was silly. Good, good defending. That out. What? How did the what? How did that even go in? Hold on one second. He missed it and he decides to go for a touch. I need to see that. Hold on. Oh, it actually did go in. Yep, it actually did. Look. Uh, there's your goal line technology. And we've conceded very early on. It's literally their second chance of the game. Yep, we approach half-time, 1-0 down. Um, we basically just lost out to a header where my defender tried to touch it. Uh, we, I should have got the the number or the, the name of the person who did that so I could sub him off. But um, I didn't. So let's check out what's going on in the rest of the league. All right. Um, let's see how Real Madrid are doing. Okay, they're, they're still no no. Let's get into the second half. Gonna make no subs. Yes, Postigo. Why was he running away? Ah, oh. oh, go on, shoot! Great finish, Oliveira. He's there. Number 25. But I don't know why he ran away though. He should have been right there in the action. But it doesn't matter. He manages to score the equaliser. So all is forgiven. There's Linson. Oh, that cross wasn't as good. Wait, why is Pestigo so far up all the time? And Linson is tired, so I'm going to need to take him off. And we'll also bring Hernandez on for Olive. Actually, no, for Estupinan. There we go, full time. Yeah, it was a 1 1 draw. It wasn't too bad. Oliveira getting the man of the match, scoring the equaliser in the second half. Yeah, the team performance was a bit disappointing. I feel like we should have done way better. Uh, what's next to do? Stadium. Stadium five weeks. One. And that says three. Okay. Uh, there's no team training to do. So, we are. I'm going to take off Linson because I need him for the next game. And we'll bring... I'm out on the right hand side and we'll get into the second game of this episode we're up against Schalke nice work Dresovic pass wasn't that great though Oliveira can't do anything oh he tackles crossed in ah oh, stupid I couldn't get there a good. Play him in. 
Oh, a stupid now with a shot, and it's a great save from the goalkeeper. Take another look at that shot. Coming in from the edge of the box. So now it's pinned to, to take it. Let's whip it in. Van Nief. Lovely. There we go. Same goal that Barcelona scored against us. A header across the goalkeeper. And the defender tries to take a touch. Yes, Sama. And that's a nice ball from Perez to Pinto. Move a sleeping on. I'm going to cross it in. A girl's there. Can't quite get to it. A stupid nun. What? No, no, no. He tripped me up. Go on, a stupid nun. Oh, my days. Go on. Free ball. Oliveira. Dresovic. Oh no, I took too long to play that through ball. It took way too long. Oh, try to get. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my word, what a goal. Wow, what a goal. I can't even. I can't complain about that one. That is wow. Top left corner as well. And uh, Dresovic couldn't get there in time. He was meant to be there anyway. He was out of position. And uh, it looks like we're going to draw this game unless we can find a last minute winner. Ah. We've drawn 1 1. Not the best of results, but their goal did really deserve a point. And uh, we dropped from first to second in the Europa League table. And uh, a bit disappointed. And, and Postigo is injured. Uh, basically one of our best defenders. Okay, we are back. Training is done. And let's get into the third game of this episode. We're up against Valencia. Oh, what? Hey, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, my. No, no. Oh, good save. And where are the defenders? Goodness me. This is why we need Postigo. He brings a certain level of calmness. Go on. Now it's a stupid man. Free. A stupid man. Lovely. Come on. 1 1. Let's go. Standard from a stupid man. Nothing less than what I expected from him. A stupid man. Oh, okay. I'll take that penalty. I was about to just whack it in. I'll take the penalty. And he gets the yellow card for that. He has a chance to put us ahead. And we put it straight down the middle. I was thinking to go right. Luckily, I changed my mind. And um, yeah, we are 2 1 up. A stupid and getting the two goals to bring us ahead. Can a stupid and get there? He can. And we've got another penalty <laughs> as I was about to shoot. Is he going to get a yellow card? No, he just gets a talking to. Right as I was about to shoot. Am I going to go down the middle? I'm going to go top left. See. Yep. He doesn't save it. He thinks I'm going to go to the right, on the right hand side. And the stupid man gets the hat trick. He hasn't uh, scored this episode. So it's nice to, uh, in his third episode, not his third episode, third game of this episode, he gets a hat trick to accommodate for all those games that he didn't score in. Oh, no, 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 no. No more conceding, please. <laughs> oh, my days. That was a good finish. I'll give it to him. Wait, is that a centre-back? I'm sure... Oh. You know what? I can't be bothered. 
I want Postigo back. But we won't be able to get him back unless he uh, returns early from injury. A stupid and gets man of the match. We win the 3 2. Nearly threw it all away there at the end. Uh, oh, okay. Estepanan and Oliveira getting their team of the month, along with Linson, who's been quite good, to be honest. Just had a, a few fitness problems. But yeah, I'm going to do some more training and I'll be back for another game. All right, team training is done. It looks like Postigo is nearly back from injury. So I'll give it one more game and then I'll bring him back. We're going to put Smallwood on the bench for Cantwell. And we'll bring on Iofa for Summer. And we'll get into the next game of this episode. We're up against Sevilla. A go. There's a stupid nine. Fantastic, brilliant finish. Look at that. That oh my, that finish was incredible. Look at that. Just hits it one touch and hits it. Now Linson. Oh wow. Okay, Smallwood. All right, <laughs> all right then. And uh, Linz again, another assist. It was a, uh, it wasn't that great of a cross, if I'm being honest. I think the header did most of the work. It's a stupid man. A stupid man! Oh, <laughs> uh, that is one of the best goals he scored. That has to be up there. That has to be up there. The cheeky chip. And it was just high enough to go over the goalkeeper's fingertips to the point where he couldn't get a touch on it. Yeah, that was a great... It would have been nice if there were some fans there instead of a brick wall or a stone wall. 3-0. The game is definitely over for them. And there we go, we get the victory. It is indeed all over. Stupid and get a man of the match. Let's see if Linson got the assist for that though. Oh, he didn't. Oh, that's unfair. Postigo is still injured, or not injured, but his health isn't the greatest. We'll bring on Van der Lely. And we'll get into the final game of this episode. It's the Europa League game against AS Roma. And with the corner. Oh, a stupid hands there. Come on. Yes. Right place, right time in the penalty area. And a very simple finish for him. One of the easiest goals he'll score in his career. Oh, Stupid Nan would have been in. Yeah, we're 1 0 up. Uh, uh, Stupid Nan getting the only goal. We're going to bring Smallwood on again for a go. Just because he scored in the last game. And hopefully you can do the same. So we can have a bit of, of a rest. Instantly, a Stupid Nan is pressing. A Stupid Nan. Finished. What a goal. From Estupinan. That finish was incredible. Look at that. Shoots it across the... Look. Just shoots across the goalkeeper. Or did it go for his legs? Hold on. Oh, no, it didn't. It just went past him. For some reason, goalkeeper decided to sit down. There we go. Full time... And this has been a very long episode. It has been really long. Yep, of course, the stupid man gets mad at the match, scoring the only two goals in this game. 
and that is going to be it for this episode if you enjoyed click that like button subscribe if you want to see more and i'll see you in the next one Thank you.